Wealth vote. Stupidly expensive things that Kanye West owns. I ain't gonna lie. I missed Wealth vote. The last show I think he posted was Trump, and I think we already watched Trump or like I don't know what it was. No, 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 no. He did it on Mr. Beast, but we watched somebody else do the most expensive drums on Mr. Beast. So I'm mm -hmm. like, yo, we can't watch this twice. That don't make no sense. Right. Like, that's, that's actually wild. So I was waiting for Wealthful to come out with a new John. And <laughs> of all people, he got someone I just know his purchase is going to be awful. So, like, it, it's just going to be great. I ain't going to lie, though. All right, so let's see. Kanye. Facts. Like I told mom, he made graduation, though, so it's all good. But, nah, seriously, though. Of course, subscribe to Wealth Vault if you guys want to watch the original video. Mm -hmm. That boy will always be on the description below because you know, as a fellow pocket watcher, <laughs> gotta support. And mom, let's get right, right into it. Let's do it, boys. I'm already on. Kanye West bought a private jet that has two floors, some of the weirdest vehicles I've ever seen, yep. and even an entire stadium. Yep. These are stupidly expensive things that yep. Kanye owns. This one's gonna and make me hurt. we all know Kanye likes to show off. This one's gonna he hurt. He permanently yeah. altered his face just to stunt, but he wasn't implanting diamonds in his forehead like Lil Uzi. Yeah. Nah, dude's addicted to icing out his teeth, because after Kanye got into a near-fatal car accident, he had his teeth swapped oh, wow. out for fakes. But he couldn't just leave him default. Oh, so he God, replaced his bottom row of teeth with $60,000 diamond encrusted gold dentures. His next upgrade, though, is jaw dropping. Because what the ah. f are these titanium dentures? Ye really paid $850,000 to look like he put a gum wrapper on his teeth. But it's I'm about to say, oh, I love that song. Everybody, yo, ma, you know that. <laughs> oh, wait, there wasn't an additional? Nah, mm. this one was fire. I ain't gonna lie. Shout out North. But, um, um, dang, dang, dang. You know the uh, fruit cup, Jones? The fruit cup lids they used to turn around, turn them down into grills. That's exactly what it just looked like. I remember when we take the the um um spearmint, a double mint gum. No, 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 no. Now you know what I'm talking. You know the juices, like the, the the juices that come in like the circle joints. You have the top, you peel it off. Right. It's like it's kind of like it's like a it, I don't know what to explain the material. It's kind of like that metallic type. Joint. It's like harder than a gum wrapper though. On the other side. Heads used to like take that. Yeah, and it would yeah. be it would be silvery on us. Heads used to take that and make grills. At least I used to take that joint. I ain't gonna lie. Again, like I told you on the other day, I was a weird young. Boy. Okay, but right. I'm saying what we used to do. So don't knock out what we used to I'm do. I'm not knocking out. We used to do take the spearmint gum or the oh, no, gum what, and flip it and put that's it. That's what in. heads used to do too yeah. before we got the juice. Rappers, what you think I'm getting a school juice from nowhere? Like, <laughs> like, yo, uh, yo. That doesn't just include a smile, because he was willing to lose millions buying one of a kind kicks. At the 50th Grammy Awards, Kanye paid 1.8 mil for a pair of Nike Air Yeezys, custom designed for his appearance. It was the first time anyone saw Kanye rock the Air Yeezy once, and it was the only time he'd ever wear them again. He wait, why did to sell wait, why did he pay? Why, wait, why did he pay two million dollars for a shoe that was made by you? Wait, what? How do you not get this for free? They're your shoes by your brand. Am I stupid? I don't know. Did he but... sell the rights to Nike or something? I he don't might. Know, I guess he sold crazy. the rights. Now he had to sell the rights to Nike. You had to take them right off as soon as you got off the stage. Oh yeah, and these is. Oh yeah. He wasn't walking around with them on. And by the way, y'all know, yeah, yo, if you if you don't like uh people being criticized or whatever, then it's not the video for you because you should know every wealth vote we coming straight for the criticism. I'm not gonna lie, and that and, and and that's not on some hater tip. That's just like yo financial yo as a financial bull yo. I used to make financial content. If you new to the John bro, like. Not saying I'm, I'm out here like, yo, I, I'm the prophet. But I'm saying like from like a, from a saving standpoint, I was big into that. I was big into saving and all that. So spending $2 million on some shoes, I think y'all know what I would say about that. I mean, I, I think it's pretty clear. Like, <laughs> so that's a uh, terrible person number one. Sell them for profit. But then he started talking crazy about Jews. So mm -hmm. he was only able see, to sell them for profit. See, see, and I'm not trying to show this on some, he like, wanted to sell them for profit. some anti-Semitic job. I'm showing mom. See, look. You think you think heads are gonna forget this in this day and age? You crazy? Crazy bro. about Jews. Oh. So he was only able to sell them for a hundred fifty thousand, and so absolutely wow. ridiculous so you lost one point six million dollar loss. But wow. losing is nothing new for Kanye. Yeah, I need you to really imagine your mind right now. You had one point six million dollars in cash. So imagine, like you know, the Mass Mr. Beast video you, that we just watched or whatever, when it was all in a big room and there was a million dollars in cash right there. Yeah, imagine just setting that on fire and just not caring at all. Could never. I don't care how much. I don't care if I was freaking um. What's his face? That one um like African or, or one king or whatever that was like a trillionaire. I don't care what it is. A million dollars going bye bye. Like bro, I'm having anxiety for like a year straight. Like mm -hmm. bro, I'm like yo, cause you know what you could do with a mill. A mill is generational wealth money tip. Like I'm like well, <laughs> after the next five years, <laughs> probably won't even be able to afford you like two years. But like I ain't gonna hold you with inflation. But nah. 
Still though. Right. And when he loses, he makes sure everyone comes oh, down nah, with him. Because this man isn't spending crazy amounts of money on his projects just to not win awards. Like for his Otis music video, Kanye destroyed a $400,000 Maybach to make it look like something out of Mad Max. But Kanye spent a million dollars on his we couldn't we wow. could we just we just, we couldn't just like fix up already busted up car for this like it it it, it had it had to be the <laughs> yeah I, I was telling mom that like we thought kylie's joint was bad this is about to be the worst one because i already knew like yo kanye bro separate the art from the artist right kanye is a fantastic musician producer all that bro right that's really fire bro he made graduation we all see the memes he really did that music is tough but Kanye is a schizophrenic narcissist. We all know his purchase is about to be terrible, bro. Like, matter of fact, like, yo, you see the heads that be glazing Kanye like Kanye is your god? I feel it. You really think he's, like, the best, bro. That's cool. But you cannot sit here and tell me he's at least not, not narcissistic. You are crazy, bro. There is no way. Like, bro, there is many clips to disprove that. Like, like, uh, or no, there's many clips to, to not disprove, to, uh, to literally prove that he is. Like, bro, come on, man. These purchases are going to be so bad. His music video touched the sky. And when he lost the award for best music video, bro did not let that slide. This video cost a million dollars, fam. I'm jumping across canyons. And Who won? If I don't win, the award show loses. Credibility. That's not even as much. Is that not mad narcissistic, bro? Yo, the proof was right there. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy, bro. Now that's funny though. Most expensive lie. video though, because he also dropped 1.2 million on the stronger video just to recreate the animated stronger movie Akira. Song. But even when nah, Kanye I, loses, I can't even he hate always makes sure he and his squad are dripped out, especially whoever he's dating at the time, because he's willing to spend a fat check just to have a glam squad follow around his girl 24/7. This includes a stylist, hairdresser, and makeup artist. Who was that? And having that many that's somebody else. That was Ky that's Kylie right there. But I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry to tell you this, but no one on the earth is this important. Like, I'm sorry. Like, to have a, to, you have to hire a whole team to follow her constantly. No one on earth is this this important. I'm sorry. Like, no, no person in humanity except oh. for Adam, if that, if he was real, <laughs> is was this important, bro. I, 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 nah, 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 nah. I'm sorry. And call me a hater or whatever. I guess I'm a hater, but no, nah, not all this, bro. And People how much was call. he paying? Apparently, racks up to 250k a year. But that uh, was reported yeah. when he was dating Kim Kardashian. Now that he's dating oh. Bianca, I wonder if they got a new team. Nothing. Who's no Bianca? Bianca's his new wife that he... Oh. <laughs> yeah, he it's looking like he be pimping around a little bit, so I'm, I'm sure he's not spending nothing. Because I ain't gonna lie. She so got her own money? Well, nah, she's uh. an art... She's a... She's not... No, not that she doesn't have... She does have her own cheese because she was an architect or whatever type John. But I'm just saying, like, have you seen... We've, we've seen pictures of her before with Kanye. It's on some wild John. Like, she always be looking crazy low-key. And I don't blame her. I'm pretty sure it's Kanye. Like, I'm actually... I'm pretty guaranteed that it's Kanye making her wear this John. Like... Because oh, okay. she's never been seen dressing up like a condom or basically just wearing no clothes. Like, bro, you think... What on God's name? What Why on... Why would you let your wife... What on God's green earth? And I'm not even a believer, but bro, y'all got to call me insecure, but I'm sorry, bro. Like, if Trill ever get a wife or a girl, it's never going to happen. But like, this this a no-go. This a no-go. I'm sorry. You're going to have to call me insecure, bro. And guess what? Guess what? Just like Rambo said, that's a good insecurity because, bro, what is this, bro? This is crazy right here. Like, I get you could show some skin. I'm not that type bull. Like, where you going to go out and wear like a Gertrude type dress? Right. But this is crazy. Bro, this giving... Bro, this giving the um the blade. If y'all know if y'all know where the blade is at, this giving the blade. I'm not gonna cap, bro. Like <laughs> this crazy, bro. This this wild right here. Like. So I assume the stylus is different. But when he's not piping down his girl, he's getting his supercars piped up. Which is why this thing that looks like a Batmobile is actually called the Yay Mobile. This all black single seater F1 racer goes zero to 60 in 2.1 seconds with a top speed of 170 miles per hour, faster than the Dark Knight's actual Batmobile, costing him $220,000. Yay wanted to be a classy superhero though, so we also spent 92 grand on a Porsche Panamera. You know what's so funny about this? We literally seen earlier, the reason that Kanye doesn't have any teeth is because he had a car crash. And you would still mm -hmm. buy expensive cars, especially ones that go this fast. Well, geniuses. Let me tell you, genius. But well, like, why yo. own one Porsche when he could own two? So he dropped another 110000 on a Porsche 911 Carrera. And he really proved he could buy anything when he dropped 400000 on a custom Maybach SUV called Executive Style. 
After you had kids, sports cars just didn't cut it. And this fully pimped out SUV puts the normal soccer mom car to shame. With red leather seats, TV screens, fully reclining chairs, and a surround sound system. This okay. van has more accessories than the average person's this, home. I just want to know the price so I can say what I got to say. not even main SUV. Kanye's main SUV is the Lamborghini Urus. The Urus is fire. I'm a and speed by a I'm long a shot with a top speed of 190 miles per hour in a 0 to 60 at 3.1 seconds. It's one of the fastest SUVs on the planet but it comes with a price tag of $233,000. Okay. Unfortunately, after adding a cream-colored mat, Wait. it also became one of the ugliest cars on the planet. Okay. Thankfully, his assistant crashed the car as she backed out. And I'm starting to think his assistant crashed the car. His assistant hates Lamborghinis because okay. he also crashed his 750K Aventador. <gasps> Okay. Someone needs We're not, to take her license I'm away. Oh I'm just should take your license away I'm if you don't subscribe now. Okay, okay. Shout out up, boy. Please subscribe to him. I see, mom. I see why our videos don't get any views. Okay, I understand now. Because they cannot let me have cheese. Because I'm really realizing it now that if I got any of this amount of money, I would take over the world. Because there is no way in God's... What, I don't care who you believe in, bro. $233,000 for a car? Bro, are you insane, bro? And the Urus is tough, but like, bro, I'm not, nah, 300K? Is you insane, my boy? You know how many businesses we can start? Do you know how many millions you could flip this 200K into, bro? Just to have the car get crashed? Oh my God. Yo, bro. Yo, y'all gotta watch the vids, bro. I'm trying to take over the world because ain't no way, bro. Ain't no way, bro. They, they just not, they gatekeeping me, bro. That's why RPM so low, because if we was making good cheese, bro, oh, nah, bro, I'm taking over. All right. But after buying two premium sports cars and two insane SUVs, Kanye decided that just wasn't enough. So we went balls to the walls and copped a ton of insanely expensive supercars, why? including this Aston Martin DBS, That's a, nice a Lamborghini car. Gallardo, oh, no. his Mercedes-Benz SLR McLaren, and a customized Bugatti Veyron FBG Par Hermes, which can reach speeds of up to 250 miles per hour. Kanye would be the guy to do a collab between a luxury car brand and a luxury fashion brand, just because he can. But his most expensive supercar will seriously blow your mind. Only one yeah, of sure 75 ever made. This Mercedes-Benz SLR Sterling Moss. Oh has yeah, this car's in GTA. Some a cool 3.5 million. Believe. And yeah, that's about how much it costs in GTA too, <laughs> which is funny, <laughs> which is hilarious. I'm not gonna lie, like, or I know it's definitely at least like a million. Um, it's at least 1.2 million in the game. But like, if it was probably around this price in the game too, I mean, it makes sense. 3.5 million. 3.5 million dollars in one object, and like in one object. And, and and in one object that as soon as that boy gets one foot off the lot, 25% of his value just disappeared. Disappeared into the ether. That is crazy. Mm. And I know, I know what y'all saying. I'm insecure. I just don't understand. You don't got no money. You jealous. And and yeah, you basically right. But let's say y'all did. Y'all seen our bitch. Y'all still think I'm buying this junk? <laughs> Especially when y'all know my favorite car ever is a Tesla. Hilarious. But hey, man, I'm gonna let y'all rock. Believe it or not, Kanye also wants some military grade vehicles. That yeah, this car is not. GTA. He tossed $1 These million down on a fleet of nine Sherp UTVs and then casually bought a $500,000 high speed Ripsaw EV2 tank. To drive and while Kanye is exercising his Second Amendment, he ensures his ex wife and friends also have the highest quality rides. He bought a $300,000 Bentley truck for Sci High the Prince and a Maybach GLS for ASAP Bari right after Bari wrecked his old one. Yeah, he bought me a new Maybach, yo. I crashed my Maybach two days ago. But his crazy. We just gonna go. If okay. someone openly admits that they crashed their super expensive car, in what reality am I about to be like, yeah, let me copy you a new one, big bro? <laughs> what? You gonna take that L? You gonna hold that L? No, ca bro, hold on. Boom, my God. That's it. Easiest gift has to be the 1.2 million dollar darts prom brawn red diamond truck. Yo, for his for? how many millions has he spent on cars so far? I'm not even counting no more. Like, it's really I'm getting not, aggravated. Who, who did he buy that for? Because that one's for himself. He said he bought it for somebody. This is so stupid. Yo, I knew Kai's video was about to get me mad, bro. Has to be the 1.2 million dollar darts prom brawn red diamond truck for his ex wife, Kim. It's an eight and a half foot. <laughs> he bought that for his ex wife. No. Hope she ain't asked for anything else, cause that was enough. What's nah, that? she wouldn't. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure Kim hate Kanye or whatever. I, I don't know. Something going on. Like they obviously had to keep in contact because they got mad kids together. But mm -hmm. like, 
I'm pretty sure not. I do definitely probably don't like each other. Dang. That's cooked. A tall beast. And yeah, it's also bulletproof. Though he might want to save the bulletproof feature for his own rights. But all the cars together come out to nine million dollars. And he spent even more millions on something for his daughter North. Okay. An entire just island it. in the Caribbean. He bought it for her second birthday. Oh, and what? it's rumored to turn it into some crazy. Wait, 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 wait. Stop, 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 stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop, stop, nah, stop. It was it was it, it was almost good. I ain't gonna lie. It was it was it was quite literally almost good. Cause I was like, okay, fine. I I I'll give it the Ky I, I I was gonna give it the Kylie justification. And then he said two years old. That's and that's when I was like, stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop, stop. For her second birthday. Yo, she's two. She's two. She's yo. She don't even know what the island means. Yo, yet. she's throwing up on herself, and you talking about some get the let's get the aisle. Yo, All right, go back a little bit. Y'all gotta stop giving these heads money, bro. I think that's just what it is. Like y'all just gotta go stop paying. Go back a little bit. Like, okay, okay. He spent even more millions on something for his daughter North, an entire island in the Caribbean. He bought it for his second birthday, and is rumored to turn it into some crazy things. Some say they're gonna turn it into a theme park with roller coasters and a water park. Others say they're gonna build a mansion. Yo, get... yo, high five, definitely my mom. Cause that's the first thing I'm thinking in my head. Okay, we gotta make a profit, which means people gotta come to this park. Who is paying to get to a to get to a theme park on an island? It's gonna cost a thousand just to get to this island. Or not to mention how much to get in itself. What? Okay, let's hear with the or. They right. don't know. They didn't say yet. Or. All right. The place to North for her 18th birthday. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me go back a little bit. Roller coasters and a water park. Others say they're going to build a mansion and give the place to North for her 18th birthday. This is due to privacy concerns that Kanye and Kim deal with on a daily basis. So having a private island for their kid if she wants more privacy makes sense. Especially since child celebrities have a history of issues from being famous their entire life. Kanye plans to use the island himself too, because he also likes to isolate himself. I mean, one of the weirdest things he spent millions on was his own jail cell. Because after his mom passed away, he wanted to make sure everything was perfect for the debut of his tribute album Donda. So during the recording, Kanye literally went underneath Mercedes-Benz Stadium to finish the album, spending 14 million over two weeks just to live in what looks like a prison cell. Kanye's temporary home made a studio apartment in the hood look like a five-star resort. But yeah, he doesn't need a resort because he owns some of the craziest pro- Wait, wait, maybe I gotta listen to that whole thing again because like, did he buy the stadium? That's what they said. He brought the stadium, but go back. He what? brought the stadium. And he lived in no, the no. basement. No, I'm sorry. I have to listen to this. Gotta be in the again. jail. Oh yeah, call call me ADHD. Call me call me. Um, what's what's the genre where you can't pay attention on uh, um attention span garbage? Now I really I'm sitting here listening, but I'm just so like in shock that like his purchases are actually this horrendous. Like I ain't even going to lie. Fourteen like, million. I yeah. didn't think it could be this bad, but it's really just the worst. Like okay. holy Let's crap. Listen to that. Again. Famous their entire life. Kanye plans to use the island himself too, because he also likes to isolate himself. Okay. I mean, one of the weirdest things he spent millions on was his own jail cell. Because after his mom passed away, he wanted to make sure everything was perfect for the debut of his tribute album Donda. So mm -hmm. during the recording, Kanye literally went underneath Mercedes-Benz Stadium to finish the album, spending 14 million over two weeks just to live in what looks like a prison cell. Kanye's temporary home made a studio apartment in the hood look like a five-star resort. But yeah, he doesn't need a resort because he owns some of the craziest properties across the country. Okay, before we get into that, okay, okay. So we can all we can all agree that Kanye is a little crazy, right? Like at least a, a little bit crazy. Like we we can all agree on that, right? Like we can we we can all passively just agree with that. Like Kanye might be a little whacked out. Like like I'm not gonna like I know earlier I said schizophrenic or whatever. Like that that was just being for the memes or whatever. And like but we we can all admit he a little crazy because. If you wanted your Donda album or whatever, whichever album he was doing, to be the best, right? I totally understand that. You want to lock yourself in the studio. You want to make sure you, you really put your work into your craft. What was stopping you from doing that at the studios that you already have? Well, being in the basement of the places he already, they're about to start telling us that he had. Why he had to pay $14 million to yeah. live in the, underneath the Mercedes um stadium? Kanye is one of the greatest artists of our generation, or better yet, of like past the last generations, right? Kanye has been doing his craft for a very long time. There's literally pictures of him, like when he first started making beats in jump. Why do we need to be under the Mercedes-Benz Stadium to finish his album? He, he, I, he's, he, wealth was literally about to tell us about all the properties he owned. Mm -hmm. I know at least one of these boys are gonna have a studio. This is Kanye we're talking about. They probably all got a little studio. They in definitely there. probably all do. What? Yeah, Kanye just tripping. Like he definitely just gotta be a little schizo. Like just a little, just a little. Cause like fourteen, you bought a stadium for what reason? What do we need this for? Why? I don't know. Okay, stop. 
Like his first home in LA, a multi-level Hollywood Hills mansion, the balcony overlooks downtown Los Angeles, and the living room is designed to look like a resort. But the bathroom is unreal, with a real aquarium behind the shower head, and even a crystal chandelier over the tub. If there's ever an earthquake, I'd be jumping out that tub faster than a cat. He also combined two apartments in one of the most expensive neighborhoods in the world, Soho in New York City. He says he really likes to stress the importance of color and its importance to our sanity, but he should drop another bag in an eye doctor, because there's almost no color. And as if two homes for himself weren't enough, he bought a $6.2 million plot of land in California. These Star Wars inspired what is that? I give it to him. I give it to him. Land is smart to buy. Land is smart to buy. Now, this thing he's about to say is probably going to be stupid, but like, yeah, land is land is always going to be a prime asset, just like real estate is going to be a prime yeah. asset. So well, I'll give him that. these domes? But I am very scared to see what he's about to say about these stupid looking domes. These, these freaking igloos that look like, like, yo, oh my God. All right, I can't for this one. He bought a $6.2 million plot of land in California. These Star Wars inspired structures on the property were a part of his design initiative called Yeezy Home and were supposed to be sustainable housing for homeless people. But he failed to secure building permits. So this grand venture was put on pause. Fortunately, this gave him more time to purchase even more wildly expensive properties. Like spending six- So what about the 6.2 mil? Like that land just gonna stay empty? Like what are we gonna do with it? No, like, I wanna know what homeless people, what? But <laughs> Yo. They got it. Okay. This is what happens when you give someone that wants to do too many things too much money. This is the problem. Like, yo, you got like, like, bro, like this, this is the joint I be talking about. Like, yo, you got like really lock in on some joints that you want to do. At least, I would say at least by a year at a time, especially with projects like this. Cause it's like, bro, like this, this, bro, this not just some joint. Like I guarantee you Kanye probably tripped out on some joints, probably like, we got to build homeless housing. All that. Not saying that that's a bad thing. Obviously, you should, we should want to be getting homeless people off the street. Who wants to live outside of the industry? It's bad. No. But he he doing it on some, like, spur of the moment, bro. He got a, I don't know, he was drinking or something, John. Just doing his John. Next thing you know, oh, I couldn't get the permits. Oh, that should have been the first thing you thought about, bro. Like, where's your yeah. assistant? She should have told you this, Now it's just sitting there. Now it worried. Now it's literally collecting dust. It's just, yo, this is $7 million in land. So now let's move on to the next creative. <laughs> creative. Yo, I'm Million. trying to tell y'all, bro. I'm not a Kanye hater. I do not hate Kanye, bro. Like, not at all, bro. Again, I, yo, some of my favorite songs ever are made by Kanye. I literally said Stronger. Stronger is in my top 10 songs ever. I love Stronger. I love that song to death, bro. But, yo, Kanye is not making no smart decisions these days. Like, none, bro. Like, I haven't seen... What's the last good decision Kanye made besides getting his deal back with Adidas, I think? And I, I don't even know how long ago that was. But, and I'm pretty sure that was under the table, too, or some junk. They didn't, even, they didn't even put that out in the press, but why would they? You know what I'm saying? But that, that's besides the point. Seven mil on another mansion. Great. <laughs> Lovely. 6.3 million on two separate lots within the Madison Golf Club community in California. Why? He bought that in an effort to be close to his family. Because he'll have a mansion on the same street as Kim, Kim's mother, and Kim's sister, Kylie. Nah. This will give him a private neighborhood within a private neighborhood. Nah. As you can tell, Kanye is really obsessed with privacy. Kanye and Kim also own a mansion in Bel Air, which they bought for a whopping nine mil. Bel Air is the most sought after location in all of no LA more. County. So they made sure this house not was decked out. They're not together no more. They don't have enough people to sleep. They be filling and sleeping in all these houses to make these purchases worth it. I mean, it is now granted it, the properties is going up in value for, for whatever reason, because how many people can even buy these houses for them to even for, for inflation to affect them that much? Like I ain't even going to hold you, bro. Has there been one good purchase here this entire... Ma the only thing I can say is the one... Is, is, I guess, the island for Stormy because I guess, like... I mean, not for Stormy. That's that's freaking Kylie's kid. Mm. For North, because that makes sense. I guess, like, when North 18 shoots, she could just be like, yo, dad, bro, John was dumb selling the island, bro. We probably get mm -hmm. the cheese back for that. So at least, like, that's cool. But, yo, any John Kanye made for himself or anybody else has been awful mm -mm. so far. Literally awful. Like, like this is most definitively right now at the very least. And we didn't even get to the rest of the video. This is worse than Kylie's, which means this is the worst one so far. Mm -hmm. And not when I say worst, not Wealthful. I mean the worst purchases on a on a on a stupidly expensive thing series by a Wealthful. This is the worst one. No mm -hmm. question. No question. No. No. Question. To the max. And Every we didn't even get to the planes yet. Cause that'd be the joint I really gold. Gold. Costing 750k. Every fridge is toilet. Now there's a skinny nah, toilet. On, Nah. There's a skippity toilet for you. Nah, man, you finishing this one by yourself, bro. 750000 for on that gold toilet that you're going to sit your butt on a crap? Yo, heads You can't even homes. use that. Yeah. Yo, heads need food. And I'm That's not even time. I'm not even time. Virtue signal? Because I know Kanye has given away John before. But, like, bro, 
You can't you can't be out here doing charities and John and then buying a million dollar toilet, bro. Like you got you gotta pick one. Either you go either either you gonna really sit here and blow all your cheese or you gonna try to help people. Like, bro, we not about to be doing this, bro. You you giving me mixed signals, bro. Like you want you wanna be smart and invest your cheese or not? Like what's yeah. up? Like, bro, a million dollar toilet, bro? Like, we'll yo, come wells. on, bro. Yo, you couldn't just get a bidet? Like, bro, seriously, bro? Nah. Nah, this oh my god, this worse than the Kylie theme park thing. Mm -hmm. Because at least that was for like a day. This is a toilet. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Mm. Yeah, I'm it's sorry. Yeah. The same price for the house. For the dog <laughs> house. For the dog house. At least the dog got a whole house. It's a toilet. What happens when the plumbing breaks? Now we mm. just got a gold statue of a toilet. Mm -hmm. Bro. Mm -hmm. Yo, Kanye. Come on, man. You too old for this, bro. You can't be doing this, John, no more, bro. Like. Yo, this is all crazy right here. Like, is encrusted with one million dollar Swarovski crystals. What? And they live under fifty k. Every fridge is encrusted with one million. The fridge has Swarovski diamonds on them. Oh, nah, I ain't watching this, bro. Nah, I'm, I'm out. Nah, I'm seriously not watching this. The refrigerator. Yo, I'm gonna crash out. Like, yo, nah, Kanye, we got a bub over this, bro. We got a bub over this. I hope this is fake. We gotta fight over this. We have to fight over this. A million in Swarovski diamonds on the fridge. Hmm. How many times you even been in this house? Exactly. Like, what? You, oh my god! Yo, this, this is, this is the type, John. Y'all might so say annoying. I'm doing too much heads up. Be like, oh, you not really like this? No, I am. This it's is so the type, annoying. John, that would make me crash out, bro. Bad, bro. Bad. Too much money. I'm crashing out if I lose ten dollars. Imagine if you just burned a million on a fridge. What? Bro, y'all crazy, bro. Yeah, yeah, y'all been on the internet too much to be trying to justify this dumb John, bro. Yeah, yeah, nah, bro. I'm not, I'm not doing it, bro. You not catching me justifying this, bro. Like, are you, bro? What, bro? I'd have broke my headphones because of this John, bro. Like, yo, yeah, yeah, I really gotta be kidding me with this, bro. I'm sitting here like, what? This? I see a million. I'm thinking, I'm like, well, what's this? A runway or some John? He a said a fridge. I'm like, huh? The John that mm -mm. keep the food cold? Mm -mm. A meal? That he probably don't even <clears throat> cook. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, I, hold on. Million dollar Swarovski crystals, and they literally throw away thirty. No, no. oh no, no. They ain't got no Every Louis fridge is encrusted with. Mom, you know what's hilarious about this too? Your fridge is worth a million dollars, correct? Right? Mm -hmm. We we already established that. Totally, you couldn't even get the fridge with the iPad. What is this, bro? This. This the this the this them classic white fridges y'all always be seeing like the joint that be like five hundred dollars like the the, the 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 like the average fridge bro mm -hmm. you put a million dollars of Swarovskis on this yo Kanye I, I see mm. what he's selling first mm. toilet and refrigerator mm. with one million dollars Swarovski crystals and they literally throw away thirty eight hundred on Louis Vuitton wrapped trash cans but one of his biggest purchases is the eleven million dollar. 12,000 acre ranch in Wyoming called the Monster Lake Ranch. Although half of the land is leased by the. Never mind. I was. Nope, nope, nope. I have to hear this. Hold on. Never mind. Nope. I was going to say something. Acre ranch you, in well, Wyoming cut me off. called the Monster Lake Ranch. Although half of the land is leased by the federal government, that didn't stop Kanye from developing the other half to his highest potential. The Cause I was gonna say at least like it's land. Like land is always gonna be worth something. Like you could you could always put businesses or something on this land to make cheese. Not out there. The federal government owns most of this land. So basically Kanye doesn't own this at all. Cause no one no one in the he US spent is above the government. On it. And they, and yet the government still basically own this boy. Now you know how crazy that is? <laughs> like it's like bro the gap like yo. I'm gonna I'm be honest with y'all. Y'all really don't own nothing. Like, like people, we really, we really don't own anything because yo, the government can find some type of way, some act, some law, some stupid John to take everything away from you, bro. I, I don't know when y'all gonna really peep game on that. And I know, obviously, I'm simplifying that boy down. Like, like, but, but there's, there is like quite literally legal processes. Like, yo, y'all see the thing that's happening with these, with these squatters, bro? Squatters are going into people's houses that they own. They own. They have the deed. And there's laws where you can't kick out a squatter even though the squatter has no paperwork or nothing to be staying in his crib. And we can't kick him out because of because of like some some stupid don't like decency or like time to give him another uh, place of residence. They broke into my house. What are you talking about? Like, yo, <laughs> yo, I never forget. The lady pulled up with the deed like, yo, I own this crib. I don't know this fool. How he get in my house? They like, nah, man, we can't kick him out. We're going to have to take it to the legal process. Yo, 
Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. And I'm not gonna say it's because of the melanin, but bro, I'm, I'm looking at cop dead in his eye. This ain't no legal process. Either you gonna get him out or I'm taking him out. So which one is gonna be, bro? Like, which one is gonna be? And then I'm gonna get arrested and bro gonna still be in my crib while I'm sitting in the jail cell. <laughs> like, that's, that is crazy that something like that can really happen, bro. Yeah, this road is cooked, bro. I keep trying to tell you, we're not we're not lasting to 2100. Like, I did it to uh, 21. Yeah, no, I said it right, 2100. Yeah, we're not lasting to that. There's no way. Like, that's cooked. The amenities With range from laws. typical country to city style. It has a stable, sheep farm, saloon, and shooting range like most farms. But it also has a skate park, go-kart track, restaurant, full office building, and maintenance shop like in the city. He also bought a second ranch in Wyoming for 14 million, named the Bighorn Mountain Ranch. This property is Connie's largest at 6,700 acres. This ranch has multiple cabins for guests, and he's even building a 70,000 square foot open air amphitheater. If his goal was to escape the city's paparazzi with these ranches, then building an arena may not have been the best idea. But That's at smart, least they though, can alternate between the countries. You can at least have your own shows at your own venue. That is kind of smart in that, in that respect. But I ain't gonna lie. How many tickets and how many times you gotta sell this boy out to recover 14 million? Like, a lot, bro. Like, a lot. Like, bro. I don't know, bro. And his other private properties. Like this $14 million vacation condo in Miami. The condo is less like a condo and more like a house stuck in the middle of an apartment building. Yo. And it just keeps on going. Because easily his most eye-catching buy was a $57.3 million Malibu beach house on the- Kanye's purchases are the worst I've ever seen! This is the worst I've ever seen in my life. The worst I've ever seen in my life. The worst thing I've ever seen in my life. And I can't, I'm trying to tell you, as a pocket watcher, real estate has are always going to need somewhere to live. Real estate is always going to be a good financial investment, right? Not when it's $57 million. Mm -mm. Because I got to keep in mind, it's good when people can at least decently afford the housing that you're selling. That's when it's always going to sell. Not when it's $60 million. This is a terrible investment. One of the worst I've ever seen in my entire life. 21 years of living. Worst investment. A water. It features a massive glass double door entryway, direct beach access, and a fire pit on top of a rooftop terrace. And I bet you can't guess how many cars the garage can fit. A whopping two cars. A $57 million house with a two car garage. Recently, he gutted the entire building and now it actually looks like a parking garage causing it to lose a massive $18 million in value. But last and certainly not least, we have Why? Kanye. Wait, but you, what was the reason for getting it? It was just like, it was just so cars? Put, so he could put his cars in there. He needed to park his car somewhere. So now he gotta buy a, a lift. No, he did this and probably forgot about it. So not only did you waste 60 mil, you also basically burned another 18. And it's like, yo, now this is just sitting collecting actual dust. It's not even a house no more. You can't even try to sell this boy. Yo, cunt, yo. He got money. Yo, Kanye is some of y'all head's ghosts. And I understand why, because he's a musical genius. A mu like, yo, a prodigy in music. But, bro, this is a... Like, yo, when I think of the statement separate art from the artist, and y'all need to really understand. Like, I always use Uzi because uh, Uzi's my favorite artist, so I can relate to him the most. But when I think of who this statement embodies perfectly, it is Kanye West. Perfect. Perfect. Be saying crazy, John. He's tweaking out, making these crazy purchases. He always be getting a controversy. Narcissism. Like, bro, his music fire. But, like, bro, besides from his art, what are y'all seeing? <laughs> he's an entrepreneur. Cuckoo yes, I could I could appreciate that. Oh my bad. I didn't mean to cut you off. That's a cuckoo for Coco Puffs. Like he again, he's also an entrepreneur. I'm not saying he doesn't like music is the only thing. He's an entrepreneur. He has to have easy a bunch of different businesses. I totally understand that. From an entrepreneurial perspective, I can respect it. Duh. I'm a pocket watcher, bro. I love business. I love finance. It's great. But all of these other these 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 other Jones is just nah. Like nah. Like, nah. like it's just it's just not hitting at all. Like, oh my god. Honey's Hidden Hills Mansion. By far the most expensive and most beautiful property at an unbelievable 60 million and 15,000 square feet. The Hidden Hills Mansion has some of the craziest and weirdest features out of all of Kanye's cribs. The playroom for the kids alone has a full ball pit, a miniature playground, and a handful of Murakami pillows that sell for about six grand a piece. Kanye also made sure to bring some of his odd art tastes. And at I least love, he made the miniature. I ain't and I love Murakami. Matter of fact, hold on. Just to prove, and I, and I really love Marikami, bro. Y'all got a peep game. I really, oh, pfft. 
You can't see the green. I know because the green screen. Yeah, just to show you, I really love Marikami, y'all. Six K? Nah, nah. I get them off. I tell y'all straight to y'all face. I get them off, Timu. <laughs> mm -hmm. You crazy, bro? What? Yeah. So the kids can play in these giant octopus-like beanbags. And in typical rich people what, fashion, five minutes there's separate bored? rooms for homework, like, morning coffee, breakfast, and a restaurant-sized pantry. Following Kanye's strange interest in color, every single room of the mansion is monochrome. The house is just as bland as his past three albums. In the bathroom, the shower spans That's the entire straight. wall that. That was with floor-to-ceiling glass doors. That's this bathroom, bathroom also has a seating area, a perfectly square tub, and the weirdest feature yet, sinkless surfaces. That's right, Why? Kanye sinks have faucets with no actual bowls. Instead, the countertop is slightly slanted down towards a coin slot drain. But when you're that rich, I guess basic plumbing is an afterthought. But they didn't forget it entirely with their two pools, two pool houses, and two hot tubs in the house's backyard. And yet, the priciest addition to the house came when Kanye bought six Savoir Royal Estate beds for $175,000 apiece, which came out to an absurd $1.05 million. And it and seventy five thousand like a piece, this which came out to John that generally does make me sad, bro. Like it generally does make me really sad. Like like actually really sad. Now I understand we all want to have a comfortable bed. Don't get it twisted. That boy troll love to get some shut eye. Love to get some sleep if I can, bro. Cause I got insomnia. Not under five. Not not a hundred seventy thousand. Nah. Uh. Uh. I, I I don't need to be comfortable that bad. Nah. Nah. Matter of fact, I'd rather sleep on cardboard. At that, that point, just give me the 175 bands. I, I, I'll sleep on the floor. Like, bro, straight up. Like, like nothing. <laughs> like, yo, uh, all I need is a pillow blanket. That's it. That's all I need. Promise, y'all. It's 175. Absurd 1.05 million. And if they ever get bored with the main house, no problem. Kanye bought two adjacent lots for 2.9 mil and 2.7 mil. And if you add up all the properties, it comes up to an estimated 200 million. Unfortunately, following a sharp decline in Kanye's fame and money, a lot of these houses have been sold or put on hold. Of course. Because after Kanye released two mid albums, got divorced, and said he loved not, he lost some fans and brand deals. Being bipolar is no joke. But what is kind of funny? Bipolar. That is bipolar? not. That is not bipolar, bro. Yo, Kanye been showing these jumps for however long, bro. Like my God, yo, Kanye been doing this type of jump crap like for the longest time, bro. This ain't bipolar. This is like, bro, you should have really locked in on some jump. You should have not been a narcissistic bull. We get it. You're successful. You've done great things. That's amazing. Can we start making great investments? Yo, you not yo, and Kanye. And I'm allowed to say this jump because Kanye literally said it himself. You are not God. He thinks he's God. You are not God. Mm -hmm. Trust me. You are not God. Yo, God, mm -hmm. we wouldn't be going through all the controversies you going through, bro. Trust. Mm -hmm. he, he would not. A lot. Like, bro, a lot of Jones, he lost bro. A lot. He sure did. All them he houses is cut. With that toilet and that refrigerator. Nah, them houses cut. All that Jones cut, bro. And you shouldn't even bought them in the first place. Like, bro, all you need is like two cribs max, bro. Maybe three. I would say the three most, the three main areas you are the most, you get a house there. So for Kanye, would that probably be New York, mm -hmm. which he had a John. Most likely LA, mm -hmm. like Cal California. Cali for e anyone famous is gonna live in Cali, bro. Mm -hmm. And then like what? Maybe Florida, cause has be going there too. Like, bro, that's it, bro. He got three ran. He had three ranches. Like ten mansions. I'm like, bro, come on, bro. It ain't, bro. You don't got this much fam, bro. Like, bro, chill. Like, it ain't even. It's how much he spends on haircuts. I mean, how many haircuts do you think a bald guy needs per month? Well, if your answer is less than thirty, you're wrong. Cause he gets a haircut every single day, and it's five hundred dollars every time. At for what was that? I could have did that for free. Every yeah, single nah, 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 nah. day, Wait, I'm and coming. it's five hundred. I do that for free. Dollars every time. I can't time. believe that's I, not a haircut for real. I can't. I can't. I I cannot. Does that say absolutely? Something? Does that no, say I'm something? Go first. I can't. I'm gonna let you go first. I'm good. I can't. No, I'm no, no. To, Does that I'm say something? Because maybe I don't see it. I'm trying. <laughs> okay, I'm trying you're gonna to calm process. down. Calm down. Five hundred dollars. I could have did that for free. How your barber absolutely destroyed you, John. And then looked you in your face and was like, yo, I'm going to need 500 for this, bro. Five. Yo, I'm looking at bro like I'm about to slap his lineage away. I'm about to smack his generations away. 500 a day. 500 for this garbage? I can do this right now. His barber should have been paying him by mistake at that. Yo, matter of fact, you got to pay me to get this cut. <laughs> and I still wouldn't take the cheese. I'm like, what? Mom, what is this? This is not style. This is not unique. This is not nothing. This is just like, that bro. That was something happened. He destroyed your head, bro. He destroyed your hair, bro. You need to go bald. That's a, that say something.
I'm trying to. Nah, try to mom. Say you know that meme with the kid? It's like, oh, we gotta go ball, and then you start crying. This is exactly what that is. Nah, we gotta go ball, bro. Well, this ain't it. We gotta go ball. Like we gotta go skin fade. Nah, this is crazy right here, bro. At this rate, Kanye spent roughly 2.5 million since he started this routine back in 2010. 500 a day on bald haircuts is truly stupidly expensive. He ain't just loyal to his barber though. He proves his loyalty to his friends too by icing them out. He even bought Jay-Z a $34,000 gold skull. This thing looks straight out of Indiana Jones. But that's the cheapest item out of all the millions he spent on jewelry because he treated himself to a one-of-a-kind T-Ray watch too. And you know he's full of them. Yo, man, how much you think it would cost if I got like Oh my God, his pictures in that. Oh my god, and I can't wait to see the price for this because that definitely gonna make me crash oh out. My god. And y'all know how I feel about watches. Watches can very much hold a lot of value, but I know this watch has no value because Kanye's he face is on this dumb crap. Man. Yeah. So anyway, thirty-four k for Jay Z skull. Yeah, how much you think? How much you think it would cost to get like a five dollar skull off Timu? I don't know. And a can of and a and a no 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 and a can of gold spray paint and hmm. create the same thing. How much yeah. you know it cost? Probably about five dollars. <laughs> nah, nah, because five dollars for the skull, maybe like spray paint oh, go to Walmart. Hours. Walmart. Now, I, I think I wait. I see, no spray paint be like, be around three to five dollars, depending on what color you trying to get. But if I'm getting gold, I'll, yeah, I would assume it's like five dollars. So it, it would cost ten dollars. Mm -hmm. Thirty four k is a salary, y'all. Somebody's salary. <laughs> that's tough, bro. Himself when he put his face. Oh yeah, oh yeah, and that same thing by the way. That's somebody's salary. Y'all gonna go ahead and say life is fair. Hmm. Interesting. In the center, made out of eight carat diamonds, which is surrounded by another ring of diamonds. But that watch was just the beginning. Kanye also dropped 300 grand on a 24 karat gold Egyptian Horus chain. And to match the chain, he spent another 300 grand on a dual pyramid ring. This thing looks more like a pair of brass knuckles more than anything. When he married Kim, Kanye wanted a piece of jewelry to represent his timeless love for her, so he bought her a 15 karat diamond. Timeless? What happened to the time? Ooh, wee, 15. Mm, how much mm. is that? Mm. How many millions is that? So yeah, y'all think this age well? Hmm. Interesting. Engagement ring. The diamond stone that in the center is valued at eight ring. million. But I guess. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. And this, 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 this and I, actually, no, let me not. Actually, no, I will say that because it's memes. It's memes, and I'm being funny, but I actually ain't trying to be true. These are the standards that heads want you to live up to, bro. This. So I guess I'm never finding love, bro. I, I guess it's cooked. Eight million? Nah, you not getting the eight million dollar ring. So now what? So that what? You mad? You mad? You wanna leave? Mm -hmm. You gonna have to leave. <laughs> that's eight mil? You gonna have to leave. Like that's wow. that's really just tough. Like <laughs> Yo. Oh my god. And they not even together no more. That's the crazy thing. <laughs> mm. This boy is timeless. Fortunately for Ye though, he never has to see her. Cause he can always dip out from LA on his private jet. But Kanye can't ride in a normal fifty million dollar private jet, so we bought a six hundred sixty seater. Four hundred million dollar private Boeing seven four. <laughs> Mom, that's more than Mom. the jets for jets. Mm -hmm. That is more for jets for jets. You know Mom, that, right? This is more. Mom, this is more. Yo, I thought Mark Cuban. Mark, no, no, that's what you. What? Okay, Mom. Again, this is how you know me and mine are perfect duo, yo. I'm definitely mom kid, bro. Cause the first thing I'm thinking in my head is, yo, Mark bought a whole plane for the Dallas Mavericks. How did Kanye, like, triple the price, bro? That's not even, like, bro, like, I'm not, yo, bro, y'all got to stop giving Kanye, Kanye his money, bro. Y'all got to gotta, gotta give Kanye, like, Monopoly money or, like, some prop cheese and make him think he's actually buying things. Y'all got to yeah. stop giving him real money, bro. Like, y'all got to stop. Y'all have to stop, bro. You, he, y'all go ahead right now because for the heads I'll be calling me insecure, all this type of say I'm wrong. I need you to go ahead right now and explain and justify to me why Kanye West needs a $400 million jet. Please tell me right now. Two floors. Shoot, I wish I had the Kahoot counting thing. Because I, I would, I would, ooh, what? Go ahead. I'll give you five seconds. Oh, my gosh. You're not justifying this, bro. This is stupid. This is stupid. Like, bro, come on, bro. Top 40 mil. What? Oh, my God. Like, 660 seater, bro. Your family maxed 20 people. 600 seats for what? Your family maxed 20 people. Like, bro, even if you had to bring your whole family, your nah, team. He's bringing, a, he's bringing his concert. Like, he having a concert. He need to make sure everybody get there. Like, whoever's in New York, he having a concert. Cali, y'all all getting in. Bro, this is crazy, bro. This is crazy. Like, please, bro. Seven, oh, which he calls the Yeezy that. floating office. 
and it costs $200,000 per hour just to operate. The main cabin alone has a king-size yeah, bed, a walk-in closet, this a cool. fully separate bathroom, cool. and an adjacent guest room. It even has an entire office That's and management cool. team for business meetings. Yeah, I can't imagine what work actually gets done there, because it also has a fully stocked bar, which I'm sure is where they spend most of their time. The plane also has a dining room with a private chef to cook, and a private lounge with recliners and TV screens. And if he ever wants to work out in flight, a fully loaded gym awaits him on the lower deck. Imagine having a plane so big, you got stairs to the second floor. It's more than just a floating office. It's more like a floating estate. Mm-hmm. That's what it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. $200,000 an, an hour. hour. Yo, he'll be only riding somewhere for Yo, one hour. And, and, and then let's really think about this. Really, Let's really think about it. How many times is he taking this plane like a week? Right. Because you better be using this boy every single week if you own this, right? <clears throat> Yo, I would say he may be using this two, maybe, maybe two to two to days out of the week, right? 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 For Yo. more than one hour. <laughs> and, and the point I'm trying to get to is not even about Kanye. Because we already know his purchasing choices are absolutely disgustingly awful. And if you say his purchases are good, you're retarded, bro. Like, I'm just going to let you know. <laughs> like, you're just dumb. So let's say, again, two days out of the week. I want to know how much the private chef getting paid because this fool still getting paid when Kanye not taking his plane, bro. He getting paid to do nothing. Yo. <laughs> Shout out to the chef. <laughs> Classics. Shout out to the chef. <laughs> Yo, that's going to become something that's stamped on the Mama Cho page. <laughs> Shout out to the chef. <laughs> like, oh, God. Yeah, nah. Um, Yeah, I don't have no clues in regards. Yeah, Kanye, Kanye has like... the worst. Yeah. Oh, uh, no, I do actually have regards, though. Shout out Wealth Ball. Yo, we love Wealth Ball videos. You know, prime pocket watchers mm -hmm. over here. I ain't gonna lie. Mm -hmm. right now. So we've been watching all his... Stu Basically, he has a series of stupidly expensive things that such and such own. So we've done Kylie, Trump, Mark Cuban. We've done everybody, right? And so and I was saying in the beginning that, like, he did Mr. Beast, but I'm like, yeah, we already did Mr. Beast from someone else. I think it was BLK Angel, I'm pretty sure. So y'all go check out him, too. But yeah... Out of all these Kanye's, it's had the worst. Mm -hmm. But I would say this is the best video because it, it got the most reaction out of both me and mom. So I would say this is the best video. But in terms of like the the, the choices, the the um um what's it called? The uh, oh yeah, the intelligence of this. Yeah. So anyway, mom, closing regards. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay, nice. So no. stupidly expensive things that Kanye no. West owns. Um, shout no. out Wealthful. Subscribe. Definitely subscribe to Wealthful. Again, we love the videos over there. They'll be making really funny Jones. I ain't gonna lie, really good Jones, you know. Love for love it for the pocket watches. Of course, it'll be down in the description below. Y'all already know. Mm -hmm. Mom, please <laughs> sign us off so I can stop looking at this. Uh, this 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 Hit this, that this, this travesty. That's Hit all that I scream. You know button. what I'm saying? <laughs> Tell Kanye I can help him. Jet. I can help him spend his money mm -hmm. on something smart. <laughs> okay. Comment whatever you want to comment. Which one you thought was the craziest to be? It was that four hundred million dollar jet. It was the it but, was the jet. Whatever. I don't even care. <laughs> like I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Not even to like cut mom off. He's he basically got two sixty million dollar houses. I don't even care about those no more. Yeah. A four hundred million dollar jet that costs two hundred thousand dollars every sixty minutes. We got a no state no. The <laughs> that's the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. I don't even know if this could be comped by anyone else. Mm -hmm. that, that's the worst. Jesus Christ. And anyway, click that subscribe button on a road to 3K. No, I'm going to be like this. Before like my video, I got to say one more thing because I just thought about this. The first one we watched, I just thought about it, was Elon. Elon got divorced all that, right? He has seven jets. Tell me how his seven jets still don't even no. add up to this. Still they don't no. even get to like nope. 10% of it. Nope. How? They go on jet for jet and some jets still don't add up. Yo. Oh my god, Air Drake was only 200 mil, bro. Kanye just said it. Kanye really is a mm -hmm. narcissist, like at heart, bro. He had to be better than everyone. Mm -hmm. Like, he really do. That's crazy. All right, make sure you guys Yo. turn on that. Post up against the bell. So that every time Mom and Tro posting a new video on his boy, <laughs> y'all already know where it's going to be at on the feed. Mm hmm. So, we're going to be heading out of here soon. Y'all already know. At the boy. <laughs> Trill. Uh -huh. I'm on. And yo, like we said in the other, uh, in, in the first video, if you haven't seen it, though, mom's going through, you know, a little John. So you probably won't see, you know, like normal videos for like a week, but you're going to see some shorts. So if you enjoy yes. the shorts, yeah. Mm -hmm. But now for y'all that enjoy the videos, um, like obviously the reactions, you know what I'm saying? We got to take like a little break. You know, mom got to recover. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm.
get the little junk going on, yeah. you know what I'm saying? But seriously, though, we love and appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? We're going to be back pretty soon, and we're going to see y'all later. Peace.